Hi guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Ball spot, thin hair, hair fall, dandruff, split ends, dry, dull looking hair. Guess what? Today I have a wonderful remedy that is going to treat all of that condition. This remedy is going to get rid of dandruff, is going to get rid of the bald spot by growing your hair, is going to lengthen your hair, it's going to get rid of split ends, it's going to get rid of dry scalp, it's going to also leave your hair glossy, shiny, and healthy, bouncing looking. So if you're interested in this video, you continue watching our first ingredient is rice and we're using rice to grow our hair because it contains a lot of antioxidant minerals and vitamins that is great for growing your hair rice have calcium magnesium iron and vitamin E our next ingredient is onion and onion help to grow the hair by boosting the level of antioxidant enzyme the enzyme help decompose hydrogen peroxide onion help to nourish your ear follicles with its rich content of sulfur our next ingredient is garlic and garlic has antimicrobial properties that help to kill germs and bacteria which is responsible for causing damage to your scalp and further inhibiting hair growth raw garlic is also known to be rich in vitamin c content that is great for promoting hair health and hair growth our next ingredient is shea butter and this is pure shea butter and shea butter is known to help to stimulate your ear follicles for faster ear growth i'm also going to be using some oils in this recipe and our first oil is sweet almond oil sweet almond oil is going to help with ear growth by penetrating deep into the hair follicles and rejuvenating the growth of your hair our next ingredient is coconut oil and coconut oil play a great role in getting rid of dry scalp it is also great for getting rid of dandruff and it also penetrates the ear follicle for faster ear growth our final oil is castor oil and this is like the main oil for hair growth this will grow your hair your lashes and it will also grow your brows now when i mix this castor oil with the rest of the ingredient it's gonna really and truly take care of dandruff dry scalp and it's gonna penetrate that ear follicles it's gonna cause the hair to grow much faster than it normally would also it's gonna have your hair looking all glossy and shiny you're also gonna need a blender and a strainer. Now the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna prepare our rice and we're gonna be making some rice water. This step you need to do overnight. So I'm just gonna measure for you. And you can choose to double up on the ingredient, okay? So I'm gonna use about one cup of rice. I'm gonna pour one cup of hot boiling water over the rice. Just one cup of hot water. Make sure the water is boiling before you pour. And then we're just gonna stir this as if you're washing it. So just basically mixing it, mixing well. And the water is gonna start to get cloudy and that exactly how you need it to be. Then you're gonna leave this for 24 hours to ferment a bit. So just cover it tightly and leave it on the countertop you do not need to put this in the refrigerator so leave this at least 24 hours leave it overnight and then the next day you're going to take it out and we're going to make the treatment next we're going to prepare our honey in. and for our honey in, we're going to be doing some blending so i'm going to use half of a large onion so i'm just going to remove the outer peel just remove the outer peel and once the outer peel has been removed, we're going to chop this for blending. So just chop the honey in. We're chopping because it's going to be easier to blend. And here is your chopped onion and we're not adding any form of a water to this. We're going to blend this as is. Next, we're going to reach for our garlic. And we're using about three cloves of garlic, and that's good. So we're gonna peel the garlic. Just peel your garlic. 
You can also crush the garlic. And here we have our three cloves of peeled garlic. I'm just gonna cut these in two. And I'm gonna put my garlic with the onion and I'm gonna blend these two together. And here is our blended onion and garlic. We're gonna pour in our strainer directly and we're gonna strain. So here is our honey and garlic water and now we're gonna put everything together. Now back to our rice water and this has been set overnight and now I'm gonna stir the rice water and I'm gonna strain my rice water. So you just need to strain it. And this is our rice water. And this is about a cup of rice water. Now we're gonna reach for our onion and garlic and we're just gonna pour this in the rice water. And we're gonna mix. Just blend all three together. And now our first step is ready. Now to use this wonderful remedy, you're gonna totally saturate your hair with this. So you're gonna pour this in a spray bottle or a cup, anything that is convenient to you, and you're gonna just saturate your hair with this. Once you do that, make sure to rub the scalp with this also. After you do that, you're gonna cover it with a steam cap. You're gonna walk around with it for at least two hours. If not, go under a dryer with it with your steam cap and sit on the there for about 30 minutes or so. After removing your steam cap or after walking around with it in your hair for about two hours, you're gonna then rinse your hair. After rinsing your hair, you're now gonna move on to step two. So I'm gonna reach for my shea butter and I'm using about a ounce of shea butter. Now I'm going to take my shea butter and I'm going to melt the shea butter. You can choose to melt your shea butter on a double boiler. Now if you do not have a double boiler, you can choose to pour some hot water in a container. Make sure the water is boiling hot. Pour it in. Set your shea butter in it. Keep stirring it until your shea butter is melt. Once your shea butter has melted, you're gonna remove it. And we're now gonna add the other ingredients. So we're using one teaspoon of sweet almond oil. Pour that in. One teaspoon of black castor oil. I like using the black castor oil. I think it's richer and I actually think it's better. However, if you do not have black castor oil, go ahead and use the one you have. You will still get benefit from it. I'm using one teaspoon of our coconut oil. And now we're gonna mix this and we're gonna mix this well. Now you wanna work fast with this to make sure that it's completely blend. So you wanna add the other oils before the shea butter is cooled because once the shea butter is cooled, it's gonna get back solid, okay? So you're just gonna blend, mix well. And this is gonna be your hair oil. And now your hair oil is ready. If you find your hair 
thinning, if you have bald spot, this is ideal for you. Now, a wonderful thing about this hair oil is that it's not only great for your hair, but it's also great for growing your brows. It is also great for growing your lashes. And the bonus to this is that it is also great for growing your nails. So this is actually a very versatile oil for your body. So step one is to use your rice, onion, and garlic water to steam your hair. And you wanna use this at least once every two weeks. And this is gonna be your hair oil that you're gonna use in your hair every other day or as much as you need it. So make sure to thoroughly oil your scalp with this at least twice per week. Also make sure to focus on the end if you have split ends and also make sure to leave it on. Do not rinse this out. So this one you rinse out, this one you leave on. This you use once per week or once every two weeks and this you use at least twice per week for best result. Even if you do not want to use the first step, make sure to use the second step because this is definitely going to help to grow your hair much faster. But the combination is going to do wonders and you're going to see much faster results once you use both together. And there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share the video and leave your comments. And if this was the first time watching, look below. You're going to see the word subscribe. Click on it and you will be subscribed. Thank you all. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.